Duncan O'Brien, and I live the dream life. I woke up this one morning and I already knew it was on and I went down there and I was like, holy shit, it's on. We got a bunch of chickens with their heads cut off around here. <laughs> this is what it feels like to run a surf contest. One o'clock then. Okay, perfect. We got our checks. These guys are gonna get paid today. Today's the first ever Catch Surf Shore Break Classic Jamie O'Brien's putting on. This is one of the things we've always done is come to Keiki Shore Break. The Keiki Catch Surf Catch Cracks contest was just an idea to have fun, to get the boys to start charging a little harder. I'm the contest director. Uh, I wish I could enter, but I cannot. Best overall performer is just big barrel, big everything. I hope you guys don't get too pounded because Ruben's our water safety and he can't swim. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tripping, I can't even get my vest on. Yeah, it's on right now. Testing it out last night, there's a few rocks down there too, it's not all sand. So I think it's a pretty much a perfect day for this. <laughs> it's kind of one of those days where it's probably shitting throughout, but everybody's going out anyways. Pretty nervous, but excited at the same time. Just want to get some good waves today or some good donuts or something. Surf, Catch Cracks, Keiki Pro, first annual. Uh, we got a couple awards to give away. First award is Poopy's uh, best race car. It was a pretty piss poor performance. So I grabbed this surfboard and ran out there and did the race car in like a one foot whitewash. No one else got to do one, so I won the 100 bucks. So I was stoked. I got to go up on the podium for the contest. I mean, yeah, I was psyched. My first, my first check ever. Oh, look. <laughs> Thank you. So the best wipeout was Josh Redman. He actually was a beach entry, showed up on the beach, and he was like, hey, can I enter the contest? I was like, you ready? He's like, yeah, I'm ready. So Josh took off on one of the biggest sets of the day and was coming off the bottom. The thing was 12 foot, and he just winded up the windows and took the heaviest stack probably he took all winter long. J. Fred just dominated the whole contest. So when he saw $700 signs in his eyes, he was just like, I'm winning this contest. <laughs> Poops is gonna get the biggest wipeouts of his life, whether it's on the land or in the water. Hey, you know, even when it's flat, we gotta go find waves, and we're like, hey, we should start head surfing. We're gonna get shacked in the grass. I got my 533 wetsuit body glove, my 94 Nash, I got my winch. I don't even know if it's gonna work. All 
this hype, bro. Everyone hype this thing up for nothing. We're out of here, bro. We're gonna go find some better hedges. We were driving around the island looking for different hedges, yeah. trying to find the best hedge. We came across the perfect Nalpaka Hawaiian hedge. There's a lot to it. I mean, who takes a surfboard and goes a, along the bush with it? They're like six feet high and the, you're falling onto straight concrete. It had thorns like this long. Did you see the thorns on this bush? Yeah, just put on your life vest, you'd be fine. Ow! You, you had to wear your life vest on this one to come out alive. Are you ready? No. I gotta do it again. We're still hedge hunting for our perfect hedge. This is just the beginning of some new sport that we created once again. Big way of hedge surfing. jumped off this bridge, it's like right in the main street in but town. You're, but you're not jumping off the bridge, you're swinging off the bridge. Yeah, no one's jumped or swinged off it probably. A little nervous here, we're sitting on top of this bridge, it's about 50, 60 feet. Pooch is heading up right now and um, yeah, we're gonna do the first swing jump off of Waiwa Bridge. But it looks pretty deep, so we're gonna go for it. Even, even if it's not deep enough, I'm still gonna do it. I'm ready to get rad, let's do this, hurry up. Back to the river fair. Felt clean. Is all the cameras on? All the cameras are on. Let's go. I busted my eardrum. Team Grom, sure. it's not busted, it's not bleeding. But your ass is busted. Son, she bunzai! I thought I was going straight down and then all of a sudden it kept so hard and then I went a little further the second time but still, oh, it's gnarly, it's, it's the rope swing first time so yeah, I'm glad that's over with. <laughs> Let's go get some lunch. Next time on Who is JLB 5.0.